If music camps had a midsummer classic, it might look and sound a little like this. The Summer Music Academy at Frostburg State University is preparing middle school and high school musicians to play in any situation to build confidence. It was um, a little challenging, especially since I don't really play outside much, and the wind blew my music over, so <laughs> on my big solo too. It was fun, and lots of people stopped by to listen to us, and that was that was amazing. Little kids were come, stopping by, Ca cars were rolling down their windows and stopping in the middle of the road. Stopping traffic is just a small price to pay to prepare for the main event, playing on the Peeler Recital Hall stage. Students work with FSU faculty and guest artists through master classes and in chamber music rehearsals during the week-long camp. These musicians quickly find out how true the old saying of practice makes perfect really is. One of the things that we focus on a lot is just um, good, healthy performance practices. So regardless of the instrument or the voice, um, just really being able to understand the instrument and or the voice and how to how to approach playing or singing in a healthy manner um, with proper technique, but also proper musicality, just be, knowing how te the, the world of technique and musicianship and musicality all come together uh, within, within what's going on in the music. Students are taught how to relax in order to boost their performance as well as learning ways to combat stage fright. Everyone is nervous when they go on the stage. Students are usually nervous because they want to play well and often their family and friends are in the audience. We tell them that nerves are a natural part of performing. As they get more experience performing, they will learn how to use their nervousness to focus. That's a big part of academy, giving the students multiple experience to perform and learn from those feelings. The Summer Music Academy is at the top of the charts with campers. We actually had a lot of time, practice time to focus on our own practicing. And I think with that, a large amount of practice that I had this week, I think I improved. It's pretty impressive, actually. Um, they're all very great instructors, and they have different views on things, which is helpful. Um, I like the different pieces and the different composers and just different ways to play things. Donor Kevin Telford's deep appreciation of music and music education is in part what led him to support the Summer Music Academy. I think it's very, very important that people have the ability to explore music and be exposed to music. and. If I can't ever be a great musician, at least I can uh, I can help be a decent patron. You know, there's an element of a uh, localness here, uh, having um, having a big sort of uh, setup in Maryland is very important because I'm from the area, and also the people involved. I mean, uh, I've known Karen uh, for a couple of years now, and I know that her passion for music is so strong and so personal uh, that you know how can I not want that to be in to be exposed to as many people as possible I mean, for me um, you know particularly with the strings I mean this is a wonderful art that has survived the test of time for so long and I mean I think it's on all of us to make sure that in all of our right parts to to have that continue when Lao first came to America from China it was at a life-changing music camp where she met new friends the experience led her to reach out to enroll a dozen Chinese students at the Music Academy. Chamber Ensemble coach Xu Ting Yao says the contribution from Chinese students helped paint a beautiful picture through music. And they have their own knowledge, they have their own background learning the music, but here they can communicate through the music itself. So it's really nice to have uh, you know, international students here to share the same goal, which is making good music. Making good music is also why guest artists from places like the Peabody Institute and Pittsburgh Symphony Orchestra visit to work with FSU faculty and the academy students. One guest artist sees these students as the future. Being a musician teenager is when they're like sponges, and um, both mentally and physically, so uh, they can hone in on their technique, 
in the physical part and the practice methods of the mental part and um, it's the time when most improvement can be made as a student. Why is it important to teach them? It's they're the next generation. Without them, music will die. Music is certainly alive in Frostburg through the Summer Music Academy. To support the Summer Music Academy, visit www.frostburg.edu slash make a gift and designate your contribution to the Summer Music Academy. Learn more about the camp at www.frostburg.edu slash SMA.